look how clara clara um, Bakagate is here so today i'm here to react to the chinese man who was caught marrying another wife i'm going to read you some few details about this incident and what caused it and what happened so um a chandina man had to tell her wife that she was going to she was going to watch to a town so after lying to her wife that, that she was going to a town on a duty her wife was by the neighbors that her husband was about to get married to another woman after which the woman had to rush to the side church together with her kids where she interrupted the ceremony so i want you to just comment and tell us if it were you what would you have done because we are all planning to get married we're all planning to get future husbands and some of you of which you already have your future husband but if it were you in this type of situation what would you have done because if it were me i would just do the same thing i would just rush to the church to save my marriage because obviously these two were married and they had not yet divorced as you're going to hear from the wife they had not yet divorced but really why can you do such a thing to your wife you're married and you go away from home in the disguise of saying that you are going out in town for a duty sure if it were you you find your husband you think that you kneel down so hard you pray for him you're like god protect my husband keep himself so that he reaches very self Kombe, the husband you you're praying for so hard is just going and planning to tie a knot with another wife can you imagine it's so sad it's so embarrassing and so upset because they have three children as you're going to be seeing them it's so sad and so alarming it's so heartening and if it were me i would just rush and save my marriage and also tell the priest as she as she did i would tell the priest that please this marriage has to be cancelled because the good thing in church they say do we have anyone here who does not support this marriage to go on as they usually say obviously i'll just stand in with my two legs and my children and say that dear priest dear pastor this marriage should not go ahead so we are going to see that video and see how this woman had to react and you're going to tell us if it were you how would you react towards this so let's go into the video let's jump into the video and see how this woman had to react because it's so sad and so let's go ahead and see so let's see what is what is in this video because we're going to find out how the the wife had to react and how the priest also had to react towards this incident that happened whereby the priest is known to be blamed because I think he didn't know that maybe the, the husband already has another wife and trying to not trying to, to tie a knot with another wife. So let's go ahead and see. <laughs> trying to stop the marriage, calling father, father, please, try to stop this marriage. So let's go ahead and see up to the end so that we try to give the comments and also we we'll hear your point of view down in the comment section below. Yeah. No, leave me alone! 
Sien endak sogor, endak sogor. Because you see, you've seen how nicely dressed they had to be. They were so dressed. And why do you accept to face an embarrassment like that? Whereby someone is dressed very nicely, you're all dressed, and yet you have another wife. You're already tied and married to another wife, and you're also doing the same thing to another wife, yet even you're not divorced. Trust me, this marriage is not the same as we speak. Because you cannot have that same trust you had with your your husband when when he has done such a thing to you that trust is killed and i don't know what is happening right now in their marriage but we pray hard that they settle everything and they find a place in their heart and the the wife herself finds a place in her heart to forgive the husband because it's not easy to forgive someone when you found out that they have betrayed your trust that you had in them it's so hard and i understand her situation and i know it's going to take time so do not forget to comment and do not forget to subscribe also hit hit the notification bell so that whenever you get a new video you're always the first to get notified just don't forget to comment down your your advice below so that the woman out there all the women out there get your advice and get to know if at all something like that happened anywhere else how would they handle such an incident because things just happen when we don't expect them so i just love you all take care i pray that all goes well in their marriage and god helps them out to settle their differences love you all ciao, ciao.